There is a high school senior in Aurora from Mexico, and he will be the first in his family to go to college. Yeah, he's pretty incredible, too. He's trading in his part-time janitor job for a chance to go to med school. <laughs> Aurora TV's Christina Savan shows us the power of his perseverance. Behind every locker is a student with a story. And let me assure you, this Hinkley High senior has a story to tell. Well, I was given the name Josue Estrada Murillo, and I was born and raised in Chihuahua, Mexico for seven years of my life. I never understood why we moved, but now that I have grown, I have learned to know that it was like for a better future. That's just gonna be plain water. Ask Josue's peers, and odds are they'll tell you he's the textbook definition of an overachiever. Okay, so I got it now, because it is in my personal beliefs. It's discipline over talent. I will study the extra hour, this extra minute. That's it. Just to oh. understand the core concept and be as successful as any other person. Oh, that makes much more sense. Even after school is over and everyone's gone for the day, you can bet it's that same type of discipline that keeps Josue going. So I'm a custodian at my own school. I've been cleaning this school for around eight months. I've learned also to value the custodians. I have school in one job. Some of these custodians have around two or three jobs. This past Christmas, it gave us our personal toilet brushes. His brushes are neatly hung in here, his locker, right next to his stethoscope as a token of where he's at and where he's going. I've been given this opportunity. I have the opportunity to study education for mostly a free uh, quote. It really hit me because I learned about the story of Malala and how in other countries like Saudi Arabia, students have to hide a pencil in a notebook. And for me to be given this opportunity and walk with my textbooks and walk with my backpack without having to hide it, it's something that a great honor. If they're, if they're giving up their lives for what I have here, I might as well take advantage of all of it. And take advantage of the educational system he did. Josue is one of four Aurora Public School students and 10 in the entire state that has been accepted into a prestigious medical program. It's an eight-year plan that allows Josue to complete his undergraduate degree at CU Denver and go on to study medicine at CU Anschutz Medical Campus. The program aims to look for students who are from diverse backgrounds. Because if you look in the medical field, statistics show that a lot of the medical field is not really diverse. Representation is key because the more voices you have, the more likely you are to succeed. Because if we just concentrate on one specific group of demographics, we're not really gonna express it. And obviously in the healthcare field, you have people from different ages. You have different people from different races. You have different people from different languages. In my own school, we have over a hundred and something languages being spoken. We are pretty diverse, I like to say. And that's something I take great pride in. But if I don't see diversity in the healthcare, it's something that is concerning. I knew that I wanted a career or a job that would allow me to help people. Because not only are you gonna help people, but you're gonna be given the honor to maybe even save lives. And for me, that, that's a great honor. Is there any doubt that guy isn't gonna make it? Oh, he's so way beyond <laughs> his years. Well, congratulations to Josue.